हेलो एवरी वन आई होप यू ऑल आर डूइंग ग्रेट इन योर लाइफ एंड इन योर स्टडीज ऑल्सो सो इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू डिस्कस हाउ यू शुड प्रिपेयर फॉर द डी आईज फॉर द मेन्स एग्जामिनेशन एंड आई विल कवर फ्रॉम बेसिक टू हाई लेवल फॉर डाटा इंटरप्रटेशन ऑल राइट एंड सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल फॉर डी आई एंड इफ़ यू आर सर्चिंग फॉर मटीरियल देन देर इज़ दिस बुक प्रोवाइडेड बाई किरण पब्लिकेशंस इन विच दे आर प्रोवाइडिंग डिफरेंट टाइप्स ऑफ डी आईज लाइक फ्रॉम लेवल वन लेवल टू लेवल थ्री लेवल फोर ऑल द टाइप्स ऑफ डी आईज आर अवेलेबल एंड ऑल द ट्रिकियर वंस आर ऑल्सो अवेलेबल लाइक विच आर फाउंड इन द मेन्स एग्जामिनेशन एंड विच यू थिंक दैट दीज डी आईज वी हैव नॉट सीन एनी वेयर सो दोज डी आईज आर ऑल्सो अवेलेबल प्लस द डिटेल्ड सोल्यूशंस आर ऑल्सो गिवन एंड एज यू कैन सी दिस इज बाई आशीष अरोड़ा सर सो ही हैज गिवन द सोल्यूशन इन हिज ओन वे लाइक द मेथड बाई विच ही टीच इज सो इफ यू आर फॉलोइंग हिम दैन दिस डी आई बुक इज बेस्ट फॉर यू एज यू कैन फाइंड हिज मैथड्स इन द सोल्यूशन दैन यू विल नॉट हैव एनी कन्फ्यूजन बिकॉज इन मेनी बुक्स द बेसिक सोल्यूशंस आर गिवन एंड इन दिस बुक यू विल फाइंड द सेम सोल्यूशंस विच यू आर रीडिंग इन हिज क्लासेज सो दिस बुक विल बी वेरी बेनिफिशियल फॉर यू आई एम गिविंग यू द लिंक ऑफ दिस बुक इन डिस्क्रिप्शन फ्रॉम देयर यू कैन गो एंड परचेज सो नाउ आई विल डिस्कस अबाउट हाउ यू शुड प्रिपेयर डी आईज so first of all i will discuss for ibps pu mains exam aspirants and then i will discuss how you can take it from the start so first of all for the people who are preparing for ibps pu mains at this time you have already cleared prelims so there is no need to practice any basic type of dis like the prelims level you need to do the high level dis and for high level i suggest you to do you know the questions which you find doable try to solve them because these questions which will give you confidence and what you should do take a mock test and just select 5 to 6 dis from it and then try to solve them from 5 to 6 dis you will be able to solve 3 to 4 or maybe it can happen that you are able to solve 2 to 3 dis only but it is not a problem as for the rest of the dis you can see the solution and try to solve them if you are able to understand the solution and if you are able to solve the di after seeing the solution then it is very good and then if you are not able to understand the solution itself then you just leave this question because there is no that much time left you need to boost your confidence on the things which you find doable and in which you have confidence that yes i can do this so this is for the di section and the second thing is keep revising your arithmetic basics because DIs are made of arithmetic the name is data interpretation itself and all the basic concepts of arithmetic are used in mains level DIs okay so try to cover your basics of arithmetic of the chapters in which you are weak and then try to solve the DI questions all right like if you are seeing a DI of time speed and distance and if you do not know the basics of time speed and distance then there is no meaning of solving that DI so first try to revise the concept and then solve it and it will be very easy for you so you have to just select 5 to 6 dis on daily basis and try to solve them that is it for dis and that will be enough and now for the beginners who are preparing what you should do when you are starting di chapter the 3 to 4 chapters which you need to know the basics like average percentage then ratio and proportion after covering these 3 to 4 chapters then you need to switch to dis and the basics of these questions are there in the prelims level di so try to watch some videos in the beginning of pre level di and then in 1 to 2 days only you will understand the basics and then you can just practice 10 to 5 or 10 to 15 dis of prelims level if you are preparing for sbi ja or sbi pu and then you can switch like as your arithmetic progresses then you can also increase your dis increase your the level of your dis like if you are doing any chapter like if you are doing time and time and time speed and distance then you can solve the dis of the same chapter 4 to 5 dis so this is what you have to do if you are covering the chapters try to include the dis as well because they will help you to revise the concept and they will not be a headache for you as the concepts are same and it will be very easy for you okay so this is what you have to do and then for prelims like if at the time of prelims you need to just 
practice the dis practice 2 to 3 mains level dis and then just practice the other dis of prelims level from the mock test and after prelims examination when you clear the pre then the same method should be followed which i have uh, which i have told for ivps po mains aspirants so that is all for this video i hope you found it useful and i wish you all the best and i wish you have a good day thank you